Well, hello everyone, and uh, welcome to Portal. You know, I haven't really heard too much about this game. Uh, it's made by Valve, which I hear it makes some great games like Half-Life, Team Fortress, and Portal, and Left 4 Dead, uh, but I've never really played any of them. So I figured I'd give this a shot. Uh, it seems like an interesting little concept. I'm not sure it'll, if it'll feel more like a game or a puzzle, but we will find out. So anyway, let's get started. I'm not really sure um, how old this game is, but it feels pretty old, and it looks pretty old. I know I hate to say this, but I might need to turn my sensitivity up. Mouse, sensitivity maybe a teensy bit higher. Okay, there we go. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all enrichment center activities, serious injuries may occur for your own safety and the safety of others. Please refrain from the portal will open in three, two, one. Ooh, oh, I'm a woman. I wondered why I was so light on my feet, and do I have some sort of like palsy or something? Is that why I need those stilts? I don't know. If they make me jump well, that's pretty cool. This is a small bed for such a big person. Got that, uh, <clears throat> the stuff that they use at the dentist's office being pumped in there, getting me high as hell. And then, uh, got this dirty toilet over here. And this horrible radio. I wonder why, like, I'm looking at myself. Oh, there we go. Checking myself out. Strike a pose, baby girl. Ooh. That's pretty cool. So is that... Whoa, okay, this, that is weird. So I would go inside... Am I inside of there? What the... This is weird. Alright, well I can move and I can jump. I'm guessing that's the robot that was talking to me. This is so weird. Pick up an object. Easy enough. Big box. I always see this around the internet. This cube. Excellent. Please proceed into the chamber lock after completing each test. First, however, note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material prevents a patient grip. Will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. For instance, the aperture science weighted storage cube. Okay. Now what? It's interesting so far. This almost reminds me of... Have y'all ever seen that show Generator Rex? Like this kind of laboratory that he's in? Everything's white and sterile. Maybe actually not too sterile. Look at these footprints. I guess I'm in some sort of like a hippie commune. That's why everyone's barefoot. Please place the weighted storage cube on the 1500 megawatt Aperture Science Heavy Duty Super Colliding Super Button. Ooh. So not through there. Oh, it keeps changing? Interesting. It's not in here with me, though. Oh, hey. Here we go. Um. Oh, there we go. Ooh, this is interesting. So I need to get it onto the button. This is very confusing to try to figure out which room is which. No, don't, don't leave it. Damn it. No, don't close. Ah. Stupid cube. Now I gotta wait. Pick it up. 
Guess I need to back my way in here. Are you kidding me? Alright, let me... What? What? Where'd it go? Hey, I thought I could make my own portal, too. Alright, so I'm good. Just need to wait for that thing to come around again. This is interesting. Aha! Now just wait for the button. Ooh, okay. Alright, pick up, pick up the thing. Pick, pick it up. There we go. Perfect. Please move quickly to the chamber lock as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. Ooh, okay. On to the next one. So far this is interesting. I'm wondering if there will be any semblance of story or anything, or if it'll just be these little puzzles. You're doing very well. Please be advised that a noticeable taste of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grip, which may, in semi-rare cases, emancipate dental fillings, crowns, tooth enamel, and teeth. <laughs> okay. So this is... something. Very good. Ooh. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. With it, you can create your own portals. These intradimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. Do not look directly at the operational end of the device. Do not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. Most importantly, under no circumstances should you... Ooh, this is interesting. Oh, look at me, I can check myself out. Mm. I like these little puma legs. All right, so where am I trying to go? I guess through here. Oh, I already beat that. That's pretty cool. Okay. Please proceed to the chamber lock. Mind the gap. Whoa, that's pretty cool. Okay, so I have to go down here? Perhaps? Oh, I know what I have to do. Ooh, I, I like that I can see myself. Bring your daughter to work day is the perfect time to have her tested. <laughs> This is pretty cool. Okay, what do we have here? Welcome to test chamber four. You're doing quite well. Oh, 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 I want to try this. Uh, just do this maybe? Here we go. Oh, hold on. Cube. Alright, I'll pick you up. Ooh, this is really cool. Once again, excellent work. As part of our required test protocol, we will not monitor the next test chamber. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. Okay. Um, so far pretty interesting. I'm interested to see what else will happen, like if we'll just stop going through tests and try to escape maybe? I don't know, I don't really know anything about this game, except I know two things. One, the robot's name, I think it's GLaDOS, and two, uh, something about cake that I've just seen on Reddit. Alright, 
let's let's shoot this thing drop it into here oh okay nope darn it where am I why can't I oh that's pretty cool oh don't fall off Ooh. Okay. And, uh, now what about you? Whoa. This is a really cool concept for a game. Never seen anything like it before. Part of a required test protocol, our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, one. Well, now what? Ooh. Pretty cool. Okay. Now where to? Are these mattresses or are they something else? Am I in an asylum? You know, I've had a loading screen in front of every level. And for a game this old and with the specs that I have, I'm kind of surprised. While safety is one of many enrichment center goals, the Aperture Science High Energy Pellet seen to the left of the chamber can and has caused permanent disabilities such as vaporization. Please be careful. Unbelievable. You. Subject name here. Must be the pride of. Subject phone call here. Just too smart for these goons. Let's see what the next room is. Mm -mm. So, are they bad? Are they good? Am I just being tested? I'm not really sure. Warning devices are required on all mobile equipment. However, alarms and flashing hazard lights have been found to agitate the high energy pellet and have therefore been disabled for your safety. Okay, okay. Ooh. I just love Good. watching that. Now use the Aperture Science Unstationary Scaffold to reach the chamber lock. Okay. Is it gonna move back? Here we go. Here we go. And... Whoa. That's pretty cool. So I guess certain things can have portals on them, and certain things can't. I really want a portal gun now. Imagine the fun you could have with that, like, shoot it at the ground, and then shoot it at something else, and then just jump through that hole and keep going. Lots of loading screens. Not too big a fan of that. that. We have added a consequence for failure. Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record, followed by death. Good luck. Okay, okay. Darn it. Alright. Will another one pop out? Crap. Oh no. Okay. Hopefully. Oh, yes. Nice. Here we go. This is so weird. It's almost like, I guess it's a mirror. I mean, imagine being able to like, look at your own back. 
by looking straight forward at that. I wonder who thought up this game, because that's pretty smart. This looks like uh, algae or like pond scum or something. Very impressive. Please note that any appearance of danger is merely a device to enhance your testing experience. Okay. Am I going up or down? I'm trying to figure that out. Here we go. The Enrichment Center regrets to inform you that this next test is impossible. Make no attempt to solve it. Uh huh. So this would get vaporized if I went through there, right? Okay. Oh god. Sneezing. Sorry about that. <laughs> The Enrichment Center apologizes for this clearly broken test chamber. Mm-hmm. Okay. Fantastic. I feel like you, you could... You remain resolute and resourceful in an atmosphere of extreme pessimism. I feel like you could do some pretty cool, like, bank robberies or, like, parkour with this kind of thing. Oh, I probably should have turned on subtitles, too. I'm sorry. I'll leave them off, though. I just won't talk over top of her. It. Hello again. Hey. Hey. Darn it. Okay. Um. Hey. Didn't think I would actually make that. Okay, so I can crouch. Don't think I can go through there though. <clears throat> Can't really shoot anything. Oh wait. But where? I don't think I can jump either. Spectacular. You appear to understand how a portal affects forward momentum, or to be more precise, how it does not. That's pretty cool. Oh wait. So, if I were to shoot that right here, nope. Whoa! Momentum, a function of mass and velocity, is conserved between portals. In layman's terms, speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. Whoa, that's awesome. I feel like this would be a pretty cool ride or something at Disney World if they had something like this. If they make it, remember who thought of it first. Me. If Valve had a theme park though, that would be pretty cool. The Enrichment Center promises to always provide a safe testing environment. In dangerous testing environment, the Enrichment Center promises to always provide useful advice. Okay, so what am I looking at? Ooh. Okay. Okay. Feel like I might have done something right. Not really sure though. Maybe. Oh, hold on. Whoops. Can I move? Am I dead? All right, so I'm in here now. Probably should shoot this. But what will that do? Hey. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Now do I just have to wait? Just keep waiting. Alright, that's a good sign. Here we go. Okay, okay. The device has 
Whoa. Whoa.